Momentum Dance Company returns to the stage with their new show, Voices. Lacey Sarika, Momentum's artistic director, joins us via Zoom with the details. Lacey, thank you so much for being here with us today. It's great to see you. Great to see you. Thank you so much for having me today. Absolutely. So I'm really excited about Voices. I got a clue about it a little bit earlier on this year. That's the title of the show, but it's also a clue as to what the show is about. Can you tell us about it? Yes. So um, this show is based on Max Richter's composition, um, which he intertwined um, Eleanor Roosevelt's reading of the International Declaration or Universal Declaration of Human Rights. Um, and so at the very beginning, um, she presented this at the United Nations and it, this is the actual reading of her um, reading the Universal Declaration of Human Rights at the United Nations in 1948. Wow, wow. what a concept. Yeah, <laughs> well, I mean, this, is, this sounds very creative. I mean, joining dance with spoken word as well as music. What made you guys decide to tackle this? Um, well, Max Richter's music is absolutely fantastic and, and moving as well. And when he came out with this album, it was really at a time that the world needed something like this, um, just kind of something to unify us, something to kind of bring us together and make us realize that this is not something new that we're going through in the world. It's something that, that has been around since 1948 and even further past that. And so um, it was just something that really spoke to me as, as an artist and to have the ability to bring people together, dancers included. Um, we have the privilege of bringing together folklorico, um, point, uh, just overall ballet and modern dance in this one show. Um, so that also speaks to the voices itself. Um, we're speaking in different genres of dance. We're speaking in different uh, voices through um, Eleanor Roosevelt and Kiki Lane, through Max Richter's music. It's just absolutely, it's just beautiful. Yeah. It does sound <laughs> so amazing. Yeah, that sounds great. It really does. So you choreographed uh, many of the pieces in the show. Am I, am I guessing right on that? All of them, yes. Wow. 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 <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what kind of challenge was that for you as, uh, as a choreographer and artistic director now of the company? Yeah, um, it's overwhelming to an extent, but it's, it's, it gives me a moment to breathe. It gives me, you know, it keeps me going as a human being. Um, outside of dance, you know, as an artist, you don't have, a lot of us don't have the privilege to do that full time. So I'm also a mother of two. I'm also a general manager of a restaurant. I'm also a wife. And so taking on an entire evening of dance was a long overhaul, but I could not have done it without the beautiful dancers that gave their hearts and souls to me and let me use them to speak um, to the audience um, through my movement and then through their bodies. Well, I'm excited yeah. to hear you say that because the thing that we love about promoting what you guys do is that the dance is always so beautiful, but there's that next step that momentum always takes to really try to make a connection and communicate something valuable to the audience. So bravo, yeah. we are looking <laughs> forward, yeah. so forward to it. Thanks for being here. Voices will premiere on Saturday, August 21st at 7 p.m. and you have an opportunity to see it on Sunday at the matinee, Sunday, August 22nd at 2 p.m. For more information, visit MomentumDanceCompany.org and get your tickets at 972-252-ARTS.